and 32 RBIs. Now the rain starting to pick up here in Ken White Field as this one it goes past the catcher and one run will score for Jessup. Jessup strikes first here in this NAIA opening round contest. They this one well struck deep in the center field and it will be corralled. Center fielder slipping there and that will allow Jessup to score another run. That was a nice play by Campbell to make the grab. He slipped in the outfield, six RBIs. Williams so far in this game, 0 for 1. Very well struck ball, deep out the left field, over the wall and gone. A home run from Williams and the Jessup Warriors answer here in the bottom of the second inning. A two run shot. The Warriors extend their lead they're now ahead four runs to one. James Williams getting his sixth home run of the sixth game. Again, only one player has recorded a hit for the Warriors in this game. It was Williams with his two-run homer, but no longer as Furry gets a big-time single there. And a run will score for Jessup as they take the lead. Right on cue, Trey Furry able to get himself on the board. On the board, they have not had a very successful game offensively. But a well-struck ball by Kate Aranon deep over the left field wall. And we'll see you later. That one is gone. Aranon, big time solo shot. Jessup pulls back in front of Point Park. We are back and forth here in Waleska, Georgia. And this one escapes the grasp of the catcher and one run will score for Jessup. Plate for Point Park. Native of Miami, Florida. This one ripped in the left field. One run scores for Jessup. Big time hit. Evan can go a long way. Potential to do even more damage. Double play chance here. Four, six, three. They will not get the double play. So another run will score for Jessup. It's now 11 to 10.